Oh my gosh. Wow. We're out here testing the Arma Limitless GT 8S Parallel. I'll zero out the GPS. Zero mile per hour. Start. It's tracking. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, shit. Oh, the car just came out. I had to almost slam into a curb. Jeez, that's far down there. My bad. <laughs> oh, he turned off of Kipling on the Wadsworth, just like, where'd that thing come from? Whoo, scary. These passes are getting scary, guys. Whoo, so much speed. <laughs> Crazy. Freaking rocket going down the road. All right, stop, read. Oh my God, 167. Guys, I hit 160 this morning. I just broke my PB in the same day by seven mile per hour. That is crazy. That is crazy. I was not expecting seven mile per hour gain. I just need a lot more feet. Look at that, 4,500 feet. Holy crap. All right guys, I was just about to upload this video and I was about to call myself the world's fastest speed run at night, but it's not true. Like a good boy, I started doing my homework. Uh, I was talking to everybody for a few weeks and a bunch of the top speed runners, they said they didn't know of a faster run at night, but somebody just informed me Tommy Tian has done 173 miles per hour a night. They sent me the video, I watched it. It was super badass. So mad props to Tommy Tian. He is a really good speed runner, but now I have to try and beat his record of 173 at night. I'm glad somebody told me that, informed me before I uploaded this video and was claiming the world's fastest at night. Um, this is just an edited clip into the video, but this is basically how the video went originally. All right, guys, we completely blew our 160 mile per hour run out of the water with that 167 mile per hour pass. We did that with our 8S parallel car and of course our 10 pounds of QS8 connectors. We're running the CHNL 5K MAH, so it's basically doubling them up to 10K MAH. Um, next, I have these new Onyx batteries, 8,000 MAH, so they're pretty close. It's gonna be cool to see if these will outperform four CHNL batteries, which I'm sure they will. They should get us into the 170s, no problem. And guys, on this video, I'm gonna go ahead and claim the world's fastest speed run at night. I talked to a bunch of the world's best speed runners and they all agree that they don't know anybody that's done a faster run at night. Uh, if you guys know somebody that's done a faster run at night, please let me know down in the comments and I will change the name of the video. I don't want to take away from anybody's glory or anybody's hard work. Sorry about all the RC cars everywhere. We've been going straight ham on the Limitless lately. I'm pretty sure I own like four Limitlesses now along with the Sawblade Limitless. And guys, if you guys been watching my channel for a while, you know this isn't the first time I claim to be the world's fastest at something. First, we did the world's fastest SCX24 last year on vacation out in California. We hit, I think, 17, 18 mile per hour, worm drive gears and everything. Uh, it's still the world's fastest from last year. Uh, I think mainly it's still the world's fastest because nobody ever puts a GPS on theirs. And then, of course, my biggest achievement is the saw blade limitless. <laughs> Woo! 
This is the world's fastest off-road limitless and still currently the world's fastest seventh eight scale off-road. And I got proof. Guys, if you're on Facebook, join the RC Off-Road Speedrun Club. It's ran by David Delamas. He's the fastest in the world off-road, 104 mile per hour. If you guys know, can get a hold of Kevin Talbot, tell him to join as well. So here's a speed run list right here on top. So as you can see, this is the fifth scale, the big scales. So we come over to the small scale, 10th, 8th scale. And as you can see, Sean Shore, number one, 89 mile per hour, limitless, off-road, number one, fastest in the world. Then of course, we have the world's fastest Losi DBXL, only off-road. I haven't done any on-road speed running yet, but it's the world's fastest off-road DBXLE and the world's slowest rebuild. But we got all the parts, we're about to rebuild that real soon. So we come back over to the list. We go to large scale. Right there, number five, Sean Shore. Low C DBXLE, 94 mile per hour. Nobody else has a DBXLE on the list. All right guys, if you guys know of a faster speed run at night, please let me know down in the comments. Uh, I don't want to take away from anybody's hard work or glory. Uh, also, let me know what you think of people claiming to be the world's fastest at anything. Do you think people should do it or not? Because I think uh, if you work hard and you become the world's fastest with anything, you should claim it. Because then people will want to beat your record. And that brings some competitiveness into the RC world. I'm not going to lie, guys. The competitiveness in the RC world, it kind of makes it a lot funner. So, if you're a new watcher, make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to click that bell because you do not want to miss any of these epic speedrun videos. Thanks for watching.